You're looking at the heat map on Manatee County's COVID-19 dashboard. The dark orange shows the highest concentration of cases. And red, we've roughly outlined the zip codes targeted by the state's new pop-up vaccine site. You can see Lakewood Ranch has fewer cases than other areas. So why are these residents getting exclusive access, 3,000 doses just for them, while the rest of Manatee hopes to be selected at random via the county's lottery system. There was no, there was no choice to, to pick certain zip codes. We wanted to find communities that had high levels of seniors living in there, and this obviously has a high concentration. At a news conference today, Governor DeSantis stressed the county also gets 6,000 additional doses from the state. But again, these 6,000 doses are for everybody. The 3,000 at Lakewood Ranch are just for the few. There's way more cases in other parts of the county. Can you commit to doing a pop-up site just for those residents as well? So we're not limiting it necessarily. So the 6,000 doses that go to the county as a matter of course. This is limited though. That, that, exactly, this is in addition to what is normally sent. The so. governor says in addition to the weekly allotment, Manatee residents can also get vaccinated at Publix. He defended this pop-up site and the 14 others across the state. But look, I mean, if Manatee County doesn't like us doing this, then we are totally fine with putting this in counties that want it. You know, I'll tell you what, I mean, I wouldn't be complaining. I'd be thankful that we're able to do it because you know what? We didn't need to do this at all.